Item Number, SCP-170 Name, A2 Above Superglue Object Class, Safe Description, SCP-170 appears to be a standard tube of superglue, in a yellow tube 13 cm long. There is no manufacturer information or any other text on the outside of the container, apart from the word superglue printed in bold letters on the front. Whenever any amount of the substance is applied to solid material, and that solid is put in contact with any surface, both objects lose molecular cohesion in the area surrounding the contact points allowing one to be pushed through the other. The effect lasts only moments, however. Within a third of a second of the two surfaces making contact, the ability of each to pass through the other is nullified, leaving both permanently bonded together. SCP-170 was seized in a raid on an illegal laboratory in Data Unavailable, in 1900 Unavailable. The unusual properties of SCP-170 were unknown until a standard test on all seized materials was performed on it. A laboratory technician used a pipette to extract a small amount of SCP-170 for analysis. Upon attempting to dispense the substance onto a slide, the pipette immediately passed straight through the slide, which was on a mount. Further tests were run upon the pipette-slash-slide, and it was discovered that they were bonded on the molecular level. Upon hearing of this, SCP personnel were dispatched to confiscate all seized materials. Special Containment Procedure, SCP-170 presents no danger, and as such can be contained safely in any secure storage locker. However, due to the potential misuse of the substance, as well the limited quantity of SCP-170 available, no personnel may remove it from storage without prior approval from Dr. Unavailable.